before I could prove that it worked. Call Francis Gabe of Newburgh what you'd like. Uh, half of Newburgh thought I was nuts, and the other half decided I was a genius. And uh, Nuts or genius, she is an artist, a sculptor, a jeweler, but most of all, Francis Gabe is an inventor, and her prize invention is the self-cleaning house. She lives in it in Newburgh, and she's been working on it off and on by herself for 29 years. I want mine to be completed when I put them on. So that's why it mark. takes some time. Yes. Yes, when I get through with this baby, it's really going to work. Okay. For instance, when completed, the self-cleaning house will have a china cabinet that also washes dishes. It will have a clothes freshener. That's what Francis calls a washer-dryer. This is all automatic, of course. Uh -huh. uh, the detergent stops when the bottle's empty. Mm -hmm. Then the water runs clear and rinses. Then the clothes dry and go right down a rod to the closet. No bending or stooping for the laundry. Stoop, stoop, stooping is stupid. All housework is stupid to Francis. The bedroom and living room all have sprinklers above. Someday when they're hooked up, they'll replace dusting and sweeping. By the way, the water would all go in a floor drain when the cleaning's done. We can show you how it works in the kitchen. It's the only operational part of the self-cleaning house right now. Today, Francis gave us a demonstration, but first she had to fix a pipe fitting that broke. Then she gave us the demonstration. Eureka! Oh. Nuts! Trouble with that same pipe fitting again. And we kind of helped out with a little strapping tape. And then finally, the demonstration of the self-cleaning kitchen in the self-cleaning house. That's good enough. And there you have it, a clean kitchen, Francis Gabe style. When she finds the time, she'll finish the house ahead of its time, washing housework right down the drain. Carl Click, News 8.